Hi to all, welcome to Rams Android Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we will discuss how to create time picker dialog. Time picker dialogs and date picker dialogs we are using to get the uh, time inputs and date in inputs from the user. Now, in this video tutorial, we will see how to create a time picker dialog. In the next video tutorial, we will see how to create a date picker dialog. So, I have created the project called time picker dialog. So, here in this project in XML file, I have created one button called select time button. So whenever I'm clicking the select time button, then I'm displaying the dialog box and user is going to select the time. And that time, again, we are displaying with the help of text view. So I have created the button and the text view. For the button, I have given the ID is a button underscore display TPD. That means time picker dialog. And the text view I have taken to display the selected time. So for that ID, I have given text view underscore display. And for this text property, I have deleted. Why? Because dynamically we are binding the data to this text view. So let us write the Java code for this. So I'm reading these methods. Why? Because those are not required here. First of all, let me create a, uh, let me call the button reference so that display TPD time picker dialog button equal to and we need to do the type casting and find you by id or dot id dot button underscore display tpd now we need to write a event handling for this button so we are writing set on click listener of new on click listener now here we need to write a program to display that that means to create a time picker dialog and to display it so that we are having the class in android called time picker dialog so now you will see the methods here in that method we have a parameters first parameter is context so that we are passing the get application context second parameter if you observe it is on time set listener that means we are populating the dialog box user is selecting the time and whenever he hits submit or ok or set that selected time we are receiving receive receiving using the interface called on time set listener so it's a callback interface for the uh, time picker dialog box and after that we need to pass the hour minute and is it is 24 hours or 12 hours view using the calendar class from java it will package so that first parameter i'm passing as get application context and second parameter is the on time set listener so to the current class i want to implement it next one is int hour of day minute and boolean so that first i need to get the calendar class instance so that calendar calendar equal to and calendar dot get instance i'm calling so that we are getting the instance for the calendar class now here next parameter we need to pass is our so that i'm uh, calling uh, calendar dot get off and we need to pass calendar class dot year uh, sorry it's a time right so hour of day next parameter we need to pass minute so that calendar again calendar dot get off again calendar class dot we need to call minute you'll observe we have a minute uh, constant next is 24 hours view so i'm giving it's 24 hours view right finally we need to call the method show method now if you observe here it is giving the compile time error why because here we passed this in interface called uh, callback interface so that we need to implement the interface to the current class why because i passed this that means the interface i'm going to implement to the current class that's why it is giving error so that just i'm going to click on that error you, uh, you, you can click here and you can say add method contract to get application context otherwise you can see any methods are available but no problem you can say it should implements with the time picker dialog dot on time uh, so on time right on time set listener so automatically just click here and you can say alt enter then it's going to 
at the unimplemented methods of this interface called on time set listener so here we have a method on time set still we are getting so probably right already implemented right on time set listener so it is again showing the error fine so here we need to give i think main activity dot this save it can hmm. dot get oh sorry here uh, this is not going to work why because uh, it's an anonymous inner type so that uh, we need to pass directly an object this is not going to work so that what i'm doing is uh, We will implement this interface as an anonymous center type so that uh, uh, we will take a time picker dialog dot on time set listener on time set listener equal to new on time set listener anonymous center type so that here in this place we are passing on time set listener see so this is the way uh, sorry for that why because we are using anonymous center types this keyboard is not going to work okay so that whenever you are going to, when we are going to use this keyword in a sense whenever you are using the methods directly to the main activity main activity methods there you can use the this because in this anonymous center type this is not going to work for us right fine so that here we have implemented uh, the interface on time set listener so that uh, just close this now simple whenever we are click the button it is displaying the time picker dialog so when user is going to set the time and is going to say OK, then this method is going to receive the time so that you will see selected hour, selected minute we can get here. So that I am going to call the text view, text view display and let me call the reference for the uh, display equal to text view and uh, find you by id r dot id dot text view underscore display now simple to this text view i am binding the selected um, hour and minute so that i am saying chosen time is and uh, just we need to pass hour of day and concatenation and within double quotes i'm saying colon and here i'm passing minute control space like concatenation minute right now finished now we can execute this program save it and execute select an emulator I'll see select time you click this one now it's going to display the dialog box to select the time so suppose I'm selecting the time this and uh, 35 minutes and I'm going to say okay then you'll see chosen time is 735 right so thank you for watching this video if you like my videos you can subscribe my channel by clicking subscribe button below and you can get the code in my blog called ram standard so this source code any uh, concept source code you can type simple time picker dialog and you search it uh, sorry and you'll get the code you need to start with a capital letter time picker dialog search oops it's 
not coming again time pickle dialog oh sorry uh, have lost the internet connection that's why it is not giving fine just you type that you'll get the concept thank you for watching we'll meet in the next video